UW360 is proudly supported by Pacific Office Automation, Copy, Print, Workflow, and IT, Problem Solved. Most of the time we can get by with a standard dose. University of Washington School of Pharmacy has three missions. One is to teach. One is to provide uh, research, and the other is to provide community service. Make sure Those three missions are woven into everything Don Downing does, in the classroom, in the community, or in a remote corner of the world. We finally got the medicine she needed to work. Yeah. As a clinical professor at the UW School of Pharmacy, Downing exemplifies his profession. Pharmacists are, are the best educated medication specialist. And I think it's important to be prepared. I'm passionate to make sure that pharmacists are there for people. And it's that kind of passion that draws students to his classes. He just opens people's eyes to the possibilities of what a pharmacist can do. Which end do you put on your ear? I love working with students. They're so smart and they're so idealistic and they're so capable of providing so much good care. Providing good care is the goal, but according to Downing, for pharmacists, it can also be a challenge. You see uh, not only uh, over-the-counter medicines, prescription bottles, you see that somebody is smoking. This represents a, a combination that leads to people being hospitalized unnecessarily. They say, take them to the pharmacy and have them do it. But in fact, the pharmacist is only paid to do one thing, and that is sell them more pills. And that has to change. Change has defined Downing's life. As a pharmacist, a teacher, and an advocate, he's traveled across the country and around the world to change this perception. People come to me, oh, you're a pill pusher, you're a pharmacist. As the media often portrays pharmacists counting pills in a tray, and, and that just, um, just reinforces the perception that that's what pharmacists are trained to do. I'm sorry, you don't need eight, a minimum of eight years of college to count by fives on a prescription tray. So what do you feel about At UW School of Pharmacy, that clinical cornerstone is built on intense training training that goes far beyond dispensing medications. They are trained to provide chronic disease management, prevent uh, chronic illnesses. They are trained to prevent infectious disease through immunizations, and uh, they also are trained to provide behavioral modification in patients whose personal behaviors are adding to their illness. Okay, you know, we have Downing is committed to change policy and laws. He spearheaded a movement to make emergency contraception readily available to women. And those signs you see in the drugstore? They're a result of Downing's determination to make health care more accessible. We see signs where pharmacists say flu shots are available here or shingles vaccines available here or travel vaccines are available here. And, and people can come in. Um, on their own terms again um, and, and, and receive those upon request. We immediately had an impact on raising immunization rates in Washington State. My work has been to change policy in Washington State to recognize pharmacists as a healthcare provider, not only recognize them, but to compensate and therefore incentivize them. For UW Pharmacy students, community service is another cornerstone beyond the borders of the classroom. Under Downing's leadership, students go everywhere from Honduras to India to Ethiopia. Well, we'll set up a mobile clinic. Uh, we'll bring physicians and dentists and pharmacists to support this effort. And we will, we will provide our students with an opportunity to see that pharmacists have a, an opportunity to work as a member of the healthcare team. Yeah. Having his, his guidance, at least for me, has been an incredible, incredible motivating factor. It gets me involved in a lot of stuff that I might not normally have done. Um, and just the energy that he brings is very contagious to all the students that I, I've talked to. And she said, I just want to say thank you. <laughs> wow. For Don Downing, the best prescription for patients is a healthcare team that works together 
for the greater good. It's really about bringing all the members of the healthcare village together to work together because in the end the patient does better. And uh, the, the quicker that we in fact learn the value of healthcare providers not competing but collaborating, the better everybody is going to do and especially the patients.